<laughs> so you want to learn how to be a YouTuber, but you only have a phone. Let me give you some tips and some adv adv advice. So if you are vlogging with just a phone, make sure that... Good lord, this camera is so... I'm struggling right now, okay? My tripods are downstairs. I'm using my bed post and a gorilla pod and if you're a youtuber you'll understand the struggle with the gorilla pod Sponsor me though. I'll shout you out and I'll make you look good between me and you But anyways if you're filming with a phone make sure you hold the phone up and not down like this Because if you're vlogging like this all they're gonna see is this and nobody wants to look at that they want to look at You know if you were looking into someone's eyes you wouldn't be looking up their nose like um Yes, uh, you look it's a lovely day, you're right. It is a lovely day outside. What are you doing, bro? No, I'm just, I'm trying to get a good angle. Step, that was so cringy. Oh my, I apologize. I'm that YouTuber now. When you're doing it like this, your arm will burn. That's called exercise, children. You'll know about that later on when you get older. But, <laughs> but no, you, you guys don't understand the stance that I have to be, and the camera's falling. The, cam the camera's falling. Gorilla pie. Well, where was I? Step two? Step two, if you want to upgrade, make sure you get a camera that you are good at using. And what I mean by that is make sure it's really simple. Like, start off with a point and shoot. More than a DSLR like all the other, like Casey Neistat. Does he even vlog anymore? I don't even know if he vlogs anymore. Let's just say, like, Fousey. Does he even vlog? I'm so bad at this dude. But, um... Start out with a point and shoot and just a simple tripod. This one's $20. I'll leave a link down in the description if you guys want to check it out. It is literally the simplest thing. You put it down, you record, you walk around with it like that. You push this button and you can use the... I'm not sponsored. What am I doing? Anyways, this is a good tripod. I, this is what I started off with with my point and shoot. Even my phone. I vlogged with my phone with this. That's how committed... That's how com- dude, no. <laughs> Oops, I made a mistake. <laughs> my first, like, my first, first tripod was not- I didn't have anything like this. Do you guys know those stick figures that you, like, you move around like the stop motion ones? Yeah, that's- that tripod is what I used before this. <laughs> Matter of fact, I'll even leave a link in the description of the video of me in Universal Studios. I was using that tripod. <laughs> Anyways, step three. Always make sure you have a schedule and you're really consist consistent. It is very hard for me to say. I think you already know I'm not really consistent. That's one reason why I'm not as big as my friends. <laughs> but um, consistency is key. I've been lacking it because consistency on YouTube is like the hardest thing you can do. That's literally the only reason why YouTube is hard. If it wasn't for consistency, it would YouTube would be a lot easier. But consistency, you have to upload when you say, on the dot, every, the exact second. Like, let's say 10.30. If it's not 10.30, it's 10.31. You probably just lost about 50% of your views. So that's what I've been lacking on. <laughs> you have to be consistent and you have to have a schedule. Like, I do daily videos. Like, I used to upload every 10.30 in the morning. I would, like, edit all night and then schedule it for 10.30 in, the, like, the next morning. And I wouldn't have to worry about the whole day. And then things went south and problems in my family. Yeah, anyways, that's this... Just be consistent and have a schedule. And number four, do not copy other people's content. Like, be creative, be unique, be different, be original. You see a lot of copycatters out here like, I honestly, I don't even know what original is anymore on YouTube, honestly. I look at Roman Atwood and Logan Paul and Literally, they're all vlogging. It's every everybody's vlogging. Even I'm vlogging. Look at this. Just try try your hardest to be original and different, and have show off your talents. Cause you never know when someone might grab you up and write you a record deal or something. I don't know. Be original. Don't steal anybody else's content. Your channel might actually get banned. Number five, the last one. Thank God this video is over, cause I'm about to stay up so long editing this. Be yourself. That does go along with the original, but honestly, like, from the bottom of my heart, be yourself. I'm about to make everybody mad on this YouTube. Watch this. Watch out. <laughs> There's a lot of people that take the fame. If you do ever get big from my, 
my my help. <laughs> Don't let fame get to your head. There's a lot of people out there that that's happened before. Trust me, I've witnessed it. I've been to Studio 71, and I you know who I'm talking about. I ain't gonna mention names. I should leave your link down in the description, but I'm not gonna do that. I'm pretty sure you're watching this too. Anyways, <laughs> where's Keemstar when you need a news report? Scare on. Just be yourself and do what you love. Do not let anybody else force you to do anything and don't do something you don't want to do. That's, that's number five. Be original and don't do what you don't love. Do what you do love. Don't do the, the don't. Alright guys, well that's our five steps on how to be a YouTuber, a YouTube sensation, even though I do not follow them, and I probably should. <laughs> yeah guys, this was off the top of my head, and from my heart, and what I know with YouTube, with my experience from VidCon, and the Studio 71 parties, and all of them, and actually talking to big YouTubers like Logan Paul, and all of them, I've gotten like, little things here and there from them saying how to be a YouTuber and I kind of just put them all together in this little video for you guys. Hopefully they're helpful. Hopefully you become successful. Hopefully you don't. If you do become successful and I'm not successful when you're successful, remember my name and remember the video that you know that helped you. This one right here. Yeah. Alright guys, hashtag set electric. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did, please give this video a like and a thumbs up. It'll help me a lot. Also, subscribe down below. If this button is still red, I'm watching you. Don't forget to hit the notification bell. If it doesn't sound like this, then you're doing it wrong. <laughs> hashtag set electric. I'll see you guys in the next video.